Hey guys, David the Fishing Pastor here, and I have a very special unboxing today that I'm super excited about. So let's get into it and let me show you what I got. All right, guys. So uh, in one of my previous videos, I did an updates for 2016. And in one of the new developments, I talked about a company called Law Dog Lures who um, I had been in contact with. Uh, well, shortly after that video, uh, the owner, Steve Lawson, he asked me to uh, be pro staff for him. And so now I'm officially pro staff for Law Dog Lures, which is awesome. Thank you, Steve, for the wonderful opportunity. Um, and I just got my custom lures from Law Dog Lures. So I want to do a special unboxing uh, for the custom lures that I got. So this video is brought to you by Law Dog Lures. So let's get into it because I'm so excited about this. I've been waiting for them to come and uh, let's take a look at what they look like. All right, so let's open this up here. Let's see, may not need a knife. don't need a knife. All right. So very cool. They gave me a whole little little box with it. That's pretty awesome. Man, sticker looks incredible. Good job, Steve. All right, so let's get this box open and see what we got here. So the first one I'm going to start off with here, this is a wake bait. Um, and this one I believe is called Aowife is the name of it. Uh, very shallow diving. And you can just see the, the incredible details, the patterns here, the dot, you know, the eyes look incredible. Uh, it has the feather treble on it. Um, and this is a shallow, really shallow uh, diving kind of crankbait. Stays really uh, near the surface. And in one of the, the lakes I like to fish, in fact, the one I just fished, Lake Hennessy, during the warmer months, you can actually see the bass chasing around the schools of shad right near the surface. So this thing is going to kill them. Uh, looks real great. It does rattle as well. Um, you know, so that's just, that's amazing. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to really love using that. That's the, the wake bait there. All right, so next up we have the translucent king crappie. Here, and that one is a square bill crankbait. And if you've seen my videos, you know I love square bill crankbaits. It was on my top five uh, favorite lures list. And this one is uh, has a has a translucent body, mostly uh, down here at the bottom, and then it has a kind of a black crappie paint job on it. Uh, really, really nice. Um, again, just a great great job there you can see that paint job is amazing and I do actually have black crappie in my local lake so that that thing is gonna kill them love love square bill crankbaits definitely gonna be one of my favorite ones alright next we have <clears throat> the two-faced terror and this one is another crankbait and honestly, I, I, I truly love crankbaits. <laughs> Whenever I get a crankbait, like in any, I buy one or I get one like in the Lucky Tackle Box or something, man, I love, love crankbaits. This one, I don't know the exact depth, but it looks like a kind of a mid-diving crankbait. And you can see it has that like neon pink color there. And, um, you know, has that, that pattern on the top. And then the cool thing is you flip it over and it has like a neon green color going there. Again, eyes look great. The details are just beautiful. Beautiful. You know, especially in, in low visibility conditions, you know, dirty water, muddy water, stuff like that. Um, colors like this really pop. So that's, that's incredible. I don't think there's a fish that's not going to be able to see this no matter what the water condition is. So really, really nice. All right, next one is another crankbait. looks like it's about the same diving depth probably um, but this one's called El Toro Rojo uh, which means the Red Bull. You see that crawfish imitating crankbait. 
And that is just beautiful. Honestly, I love that. Love that whole pattern. Paint on there. The red eyes. It, you know, honestly, it's, it's a small detail. But it can make a huge, huge difference. Um, and, you know, those red eyes, they look so much. Even the, the way they come out, they look so much like uh, uh, crawfish eyes. And I have crawfish in a lot of the lakes that I fish. So that's going to, again, just, that's going to kill them. It's going to do an amazing, amazing job. But just a wonderful, wonderful paint job on that. These things are really nice. You know, I, everything that I do personally, I love doing, whether it's fishing or pastoring, or whatever I'm doing, I do it with a lot of passion. And I really appreciate people um, who put a lot of passion into what they do as well. And I can just see through these that Steve Lawson, man, a lot of passion in what he does. You can just see it in, in his work. It's 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 amazing. Uh, so next one we have is a jerk bait, and this is uh, this one's called brook trout. We have that one here. And again, just just incredible, incredible attention to detail. You can see that. You can see the all the dots. It has the, the, the kind of the stripes there. Even has this little piece right here. And the eyes. This one has the three treble hooks on there. And then again the feather treble on the back. Just beautiful, beautiful, amazing detail. It has this uh, kind of a purple. Sorry, kind of a purple to a bluish color going down. And it has the uh, kind of a greenish brown on the sides here. Just Just amazing. In all honesty, I almost don't even want to like throw any of these into the water. <laughs> I'm going to, but almost don't want to. So that's the jerk bait, it's brook trout. And then we have a, a top water top water bait. And this one's the, the biggest one of them all. This thing's pretty pretty chunky here. But uh, it's real nice. This one's called the Mystery Machine. And uh, it's it's I believe it's a reference to Scooby Doo. Let me move the light over a little bit so you can see it better. Um, a reference to the Scooby-Doo Mystery Machine is what I'm assuming. But it's, again, just that chartreuse blue orange on the bottom there. And then that feather complements it so well. It goes perfectly with it. Again, three trebles. And you can just see that. That is a nice bait. And the water's starting to warm up. We're headed into spring, into warmer water where the fish are going to start hitting top waters. Uh, and my local lake, they, uh, I've caught them on prop baits and uh, uh, poppers and, and, and frogs and stuff. Or, or they've hit frogs. I've never caught them on frogs, but they've hit them. And uh, this is just going to do so well. We have some pretty big fish in our lake. And that is going to get them. So, there you go. Again, these lures are beautiful. The craftsmanship... The passion that has been put into making these, you can see, is incredible. You have to have to get your hands on some of these. But that is the Law Dog Lures line up there. All right, there you go, guys. That is my custom lure unboxing brought to you by Law Dog Lures. And again, I'm going to leave the uh, link in the description below so you can check them out on Facebook and Instagram. Go give them a like and a follow. Let them know the fishing pastor sent you. But most of all, get your hands on some of these lures. They look incredible. I know they're going to fish incredible, and I cannot wait to get out there and catch some nice bass on these. Uh, so thanks again, you guys, for watching. Uh, you're amazing. I am going to... Uh, post up the announcement for the 100 subscriber giveaway very, very soon. And I have something very special as well. And um, don't forget to like and subscribe and share uh, my videos if you can. Thank you guys so much. God bless you. And I will see you in my next video.